Hey, what is going on guys? This is Tharsha and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're back with another update video on our Season 9 War of the Ring campaign and Lord of the Rings Rise to War. So if you guys do enjoy this video, if you do, please do drop a like, comment and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to turn on those post notifications. Anyway, let's get straight into it. So it's going to be a pretty quick video probably just because the season is kind of over. In terms of over, I just mean objectives and you know you, you you'll see on the map okay so let's go have a look at the map then we'll have a look at the season objectives and stuff like that fellowship power and all of that so click on the map and zoom out and as you can see yeah we own we own pretty much everything like uh the fellowship uh at nearly at mount doom or are they at mount doom yeah no the fellowship are at mount doom and as you can see we own that we own baradur so yeah, we own uh, we own all of that. Uh, there's a big fight going on over here. 3.8 million, 1.2 mil deaths, and that's just pushing for Hills of Rune. The rest of the map, as you can see, we took over everything here. So, uh, Gundabad, uh, they lost their capital. Uh, we have, you know, Condom as well. The only thing they have is, for some reason, they have Emmanuel. <laughs> So I'm not sure why they have that, but yeah, they just have that one territory and then down here in the south they have a couple more territories as well that we haven't gone and taken, so yeah. But besides that, we took everything important. We got the fellowship to their destination. You know, they're gonna burn the ring, throw it into Mount Doom if Frodo can do that, or, you know, so long as Sam is there. Uh, we got Barrett Dur, we took uh, Dol Guldur today, so we do have that as well. So yeah, that's, that's, our, that's our season map, as you can see. Good, definitely triumphed, even with the absolute, you know, just the craziness that was the evil bots. Like when we were trying to break through the Black Gate, there were so many bots. It just, it was a massive, massive warp and it took us like an extra day or two, maybe even, yeah, I think it took us like an extra two days maybe to get through there just because of the amount of bots that they were holding us back. But yeah, let's go and have a look at the fellowship over here. So as you can see, we've done all the objectives we are at number 10 the ring destroyed which we've done as well we're going to have a look at target we'll see where i've got rings power done i've got discipline frontline re uh, reconnaissance and develop and expand uh for teamwork i'm in the top 150 which is great because that gives me 600 uh of the thingies the points um 102 at the moment with 4600 contribution only so i do need to you know make sure i grind that up a bit control we have war of the ring we have full siege and capital defense everything is good over there in terms of ranking if we go to fellowship production we can see fury is number one with 2.4 mil home is number two with 2.3 mil Nold is at three with 1.9 mil four is lich with 1.5 uh five is s back with 1.1 six is ring with 1 million so damn we're actually at number six nice We've definitely come a long way. Number seven, we have Wild at 1 million. Eight is BTEM with 820k. Nine is Rogu with 780k. And 10 is Grey with 770,000. In terms of my own commanders, I have Gimli at 45, Awen at 45, Helder at 45 as well. And Arwen is at 43, but she hasn't been used for anything for quite a while now. So yeah, I don't actually know what I want to do because Helder really disappointed me this season. Like, I'm not impressed with his reports. Like, I thought I would be doing a lot better with this gear, yeah, you know? And, I mean, I'm gonna get him that uh, a legendary accessory. I'll give him plus two more attack. So, maybe, I don't know, maybe he'll do better against a good faction because he just he's just not cutting it. Like, he, he's, he's, he's definitely underperforming. He's not, he's not doing what I thought he would be. I thought he'd be doing a lot better with, you know, with all the extra attack that his archers get and you know with his guide and his galadrim and all of that but yeah hey he hasn't performed as well as i hoped as as well as i expected so we're gonna have to see whether we want to retire him next season or what because i did kind of invest a lot into full range gear so we could maybe move that over to gandalf but then none of this is focus based so uh, yeah i don't know I guess we could move this over to Gandalf instead, but we'll we'll just have to see. We'll have to see. I'm not really sure what to do with Helder and Arwen at the moment. Obviously, our staples are Gimli and Eowyn, but we do need to find a good third, whether it's whether it's Helder, whether it's Arwen, whether we decide to go back to Galadriel. I am not sure, but yeah, that is the that's. Oh, actually, I want to show you guys one thing. 
My prestige, I'm at 462,000. Yeah, very low, I know. Compared to my previous seasons, like, if we go and have a look, right? Uh, last season, uh, I had personal prestige 720,000. Season before, I had 1.7 million prestige. Like, goddamn, 1.7 million prestige. Before that, I had 1.3 million prestige. Before that, I had 950k. So, yeah, this is definitely a much lower prestige season though we still have some time so we're gonna see how that goes uh what happened over here someone attacked Gimli oh it was barely it wasn't full at all it wasn't a full army but just just put that over there and go reinforce him so reinforce my Gimli over there we have Helder over here on, def on defense and actually let's move him over here and get him defending and then we'll send Eowyn to attack that guy is this guy is probably full, so let's just yellow him in. Don't know what what they have, but it's fine. Hopefully it's not a Witch King, because rip A1. But yeah, hope you guys do enjoy this video. And I'm probably not going to be doing another one, because season's pretty much over. So I'm not going to be doing another update video. I'll probably go and do a commander build or a ranking video or something. So let me know what type of uh, Rise to War video you guys would like to see next. Anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please do drop a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to turn on those post notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.